Hi, Professor Stad and the rest of English 301. My name is Amanda Shaw, and for week one assignment, it is on the limitations of common sense. So that would be what this week's assignment is. So the first thing to discuss really is what is common sense? You're talking about it, its limitations, but the important thing to know is what really is common sense. So the way I think about it is breaking it down. So what the word common means to me is something that is widely accepted or known by the average person or majority of people. So when you say common sense, it doesn't necessarily have to be positive or negative. It's just a perspective. So with that being said, talking about the limitations of it. There's many limitations, so I kind of broke it down into different categories. First one is cultural limitations. So with that, that can necessarily that can be your background, where you're from, how you were raised, your culture. So a perfect example would be, I don't know, religion. So say it is common sense in the Jewish religion that you are not supposed to have tattoos because you cannot be buried in a Jewish cemetery. So th that's common sense for a Jewish person. However, somebody who's, say, Catholic may not necessarily, that may not be common sense for them. And they may have other uh, beliefs that are common for them, but not necessarily common for other religions. So basically your culture, how you were raised, your background, um, all the experiences of your ancestors, that can all influence what is considered common sense.